UTEP football season is officially here, and with it, some clarity from Miners head coach Dana Dimmel on the status of suspended quarterback Kai Loxley. UTEP players reported for training camp this afternoon, but Loxley was not with them. You'll remember that he was suspended from the team after his arrest on June 8th for a myriad of charges, including making a terroristic threat. Today, Dimmel told KTSM that UTEP will start training camp on Friday without Loxley and likely practice without him on Saturday as well. UTEP will then make a decision on his status with the team before they go to Rudoso on Sunday for a week of camp. Now, without Loxley, that means Brandon Jones is QB1 as the Miners begin fall camp. Well, where we are with Kai right now is that we're going to make a decision before we head to Rio Dosa on what Kai's status will be, and that will be released right now. And so we'll just leave it at that right now. The decision is going to be made by the weekend. Right now, you know, we're going to start off camp with Brandon Jones as the number one uh, at this point. But it's going to be an interesting uh, uh, camp for us just because of the fact that uh, we could have up to seven quarterbacks repping at that position. You just talked about those seven quarterbacks. Well, they are Brandon Jones, Mark Torres, TJ Goodwin, Calvin Brownholtz, and junior college tra transfers Gavin Hardison and Isaiah Bravo. The last one? Well, that would be Kai Loxley. So read between the lines there. The Miners have been increasingly confident that he will be back this season. Expect even more clarity very soon.